There you go. Good one. He's all right. A little mag attack. I know you call him a good mag. <laughs> yeah. It's a fat mag. A chubby. Ooh. Ooh, that was kind of a little, a little salty there. Double. No? No waiting, no waiting, guys. No waiting. That's a good one. Oh. Okay, happened to me. Uh, yeah. What's up, everybody? Bonnie here. Welcome back to another video. So good to have you. Thanks for tuning in. Today, we're going to be fishing with live shrimp. We're out here at the beach. I went down there to check it out and I think I was seeing a school of uh, black drum. Hopefully that's the case because black drum will take live shrimp. Hopefully they're chewing, man. We'll see what happens. Let's go. He ate it. He ate it. He, he ate, ate it. it. Oh, no. Black, black drum? Yeah, man. What the heck? What? Dang. I hit. I cast it right right in the school with one hit it. They're still there, though. Let's see. Yeah, Let's see man. if they'll take this fresh, go get him. fresh shrimp here. Some action. Let's get some action on it. Well, a school of black drum right now. A lot of, like, little ones, but they've you been finicky. Good. good one. That's oh, a better one. Oh yeah. There's like 10 of them out there. One of them's gotta be hungry. More, probably more than 10, man. Oh yeah, that's a good one. That's a keeper. Sight fishing black grub. A lot of fun, man. Fishing with live shrimp. That's, that's, a, that's what you call a good eating size black drum right there. Good table fare. White meat, good blackened. We're taking this guy home. That's a good eating size there. Oh yeah. Good deal, man. Thank you. Go ahead and get you one, man. Look at that, guys. You can hear him drumming. Cool. Stole this guy in the cooler. Haven't had black drum in like years, actually. All right, let's see if we can't get another one on camera here. They're still there, man. They're still there along, along with the school of school of uh, mullet. At first we thought they were um, redfish. There might've been a school of redfish that came by earlier, but I don't know. They look very similar. Here we go. Let's see if we can get another one. Oh yeah. one more shrimp and then I'll leave. Go ahead, man. No, use it. Use it up. Free lining, the best presentation when when it comes to this situation where you see like a school of uh, fish just like floating on top like this, like redfish, snook, or um, black drum in this case. You want a free line for the most natural presentation. If you if you were to use weight, it might spook them. I don't know, but have better luck with uh, free line. Oh, there you go. I think they, they just swam towards my bait. One of them's got to be hungry. Here we go. Got one to bite, another one. A lot, a lot of casting, man. Here we go. About the same size as the other one. Oh yeah, nice. Oh, cool. Do you want to keep some, man? No? Oh yeah, that's right. You don't really like black drum. Gotta be 14 inches. Let's get this guy a measure. Pretty sure he's 14, man. He's he looks like he's big enough. Yeah, I'm drumming. Zero. Oh yeah. 14. 14 inch. Perfect size. I have a fish fry tonight. Probably gonna keep like two. I think two is plenty for the night. The rest is gonna be catch and release. But we gotta use up all the shrimp we got though. Two is plenty for me and my camera guy. You got one? Yeah. Nice. Persistent. Yeah, I just eating live shrimp, man. Would you get them on jig too, right? Look at him chasing. Oh yeah. Oh, that's a jack trying to get Look that shrimp. <laughs> jack trying, trying to get, get the, the jig off uh, his mouth. Yeah. Watch that rod. Watch that. There you go. There you want you me to unhook him? Hey, he's drumming for you, though. Yeah. You want a picture? Sure. You know. Yeah, he finally wanted it. Yeah, it's still there. 
grow big, because they sure do. Yeah, they do. I thought I had a big Oh, on it. Oh yeah. You hit it. As soon as as soon as that shrimp hit the uh, the water. Oh, what is that, a jack? Oh, there's a school of jack too mixed in. That's what was chasing that? that other uh Look drum. at that. Why isn't he taking off though? <laughs> they usually take off. It's a pretty good sized jack too, man. A lot of fun to fight too. I'm going to go down here and land him. I have to break my rod. This guy here is a little heavier. Oh, there you go. A little drag screaming. This guy's just coming. Look at him coming up close. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. There's some nice size ones, too. Mm -hmm. it's on fire over here, guys. <laughs> Pretty good sized jack right there. Hungry man's pompano. Yeah. Canal tuna. Peace out. Oh, Mark. Oh, no way. I didn't even set the hook on it, on him. Just raise the rod tip and uh, sometimes you hook them, sometimes you don't with the circle hook. You don't always, you don't always hook them. We're just hooking it near the tail so we can cast uh, get the casting distance with it. Let's see here. All right, guys, that is gonna be a wrap, man. It's super hot out. Not to be complaining, but it's it's brutal. So we're gonna call it a day. Um, I would have stayed a little longer if the bite was hot, but I mean. I'd make like 20 casts, 30 casts just to get a bite. And the fish were, I don't know, they'll, they'll like swim around the area. They wouldn't leave, but it's hard to get them to bite. So maybe we'll come back out here again next time. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.